having a family meeting. There's the president. This is a very valid point. Yes. We've been whispering because we don't want to wake up the baby. Please Eddie. give us tips because Ryan is horrible. Eddie. Guys, we're having a family meeting. If you'd like to sit in on a family meeting, uh -oh. you can hear a little bit about how this conversation Just is going to go. Just so you guys know, this is not a normal thing. We've never really had one of these before. We have family meetings, not in the office, but we ha we're having a family meeting. There's the president. There's the executive. Wait, I'm, like, what about I'm the CEO. <laughs> wait, wait, here we go. wait, wait, there's the CEO. President, no, he's the president, I'm the CEO. Okay. And our, um, what are colleagues. they? Colleagues, our colleagues, our partners, the team, this is the team. And we are discussing, go ahead, go ahead. Rank and file. Rank and file. So we're uh, discussing the positives and the negatives of having Brennan drive back and forth from the uh, academic institution, institution. <laughs> calls high school. So the positives and the negatives, we're talking a little bit about them and we're just talking about how it's kind of a drag to take the bus when you're a sophomore and a junior. So Brennan has his driver's license now and it's not too far to go to school. So we're thinking about the possibility of maybe trying out one week of Brennan taking Katie and himself independently to school. And we have a third car. That's another factor in this whole thing. So you have a car, I have a car, and then Brennan could use a car. All right. Uh, so Point, one counterpoint. Thing that we're concerned about is that you, you, and only you, uh, would hold up or follow up the um, departure uh, time. That is true. One hundred percent. That's what you're. See, no, here's what, I'm, here's what I'm proposing. Uh -huh. With our current ride, mm -hmm. Ethan, mm -hmm. um, he comes, and when he comes, I have to be at the door. So no matter what. I have to get out the door. If I don't have my makeup on, I go to school without makeup on. Like, that's how it has to be because he is getting us at this time. Yes. In addition to that, he also has a senior spot, which uh. is right next to the school. Whereas, if Brennan were to take me, not only would I be late getting out the door, uh -huh. we would have to park at the park across the street and then walk over, which takes an extra, like, 15 minutes. Yeah. At minimum 15 good, minutes. Good so that seems, and I stay up late doing homework, and so I think. So basically, this plan isn't going to work for Katie because of her time management, <laughs> or lack of time management skills. <laughs> Pretty much, that's it. Okay, so I think so this is a very valid point. Yes. Um, so I'm just saying, it, I think. If we were to continue on the Ethan track, mm. I, well, this is gonna sound like a very irrelevant point to you guys, but to mom, it would make it easier for me to dress nicer, so I'd have more time. <laughs> so, As proven by the first two days of school, not. Excuse this me? This is the third day. I said the first two days. It's just because I didn't feel like it. You just got up earlier because you went to bed earlier. I got up earlier because I was going to pop off today. Okay, we've already touched how, how late does your practice get? I don't know. Cheerleading practice. I don't 4 know. 4.30. 4.30? Does that interfere with your sleep? No. Who's coming home from practice at 9.30 interfere No. Nope. Brendan was in bed by like 10, yeah. Yeah, he has good time management. Well, All right. It's not me, so I'm just saying. This is what we learn, though. You learn. It's, it's you, time to learn like, that. I will have... And it's a net lose for you. No, yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah. Then you what, can take the bus. I'm not taking that. Would that would be you a wake lose, up lose. even earlier than <laughs> Brennan, so that's yeah. not gonna happen. But what time you picked, were you picked up this morning when you raced out the door? I didn't race. I strutted, and six fifty. I wouldn't feel I wouldn't feel nearly as much terrible. pressure it's not going to so get well. out the so door exactly. if Brian was driving. Like, okay. Well, no, because then happen. he would God, he would wait. He's going to the football game. Oh, Have fun. <laughs> Brendan's hanging out over here with Kitty. <laughs> He's so amazed because she never sleeps on his lap. Tasha's bullying over there. She's just totally hanging out. Aww. It's been a while now. We've been whispering because we don't want to wake up the baby. <laughs> All right, so the last we saw you guys, we were having our family meeting. What did we decide, Brennan, on the whole driving thing? We'll be driving next week to school. Fantastic. We're going to give it a week. We're going to do a pilot program for a week. 
See how it goes. I think Katie's gonna be fine with it. Would you say two? Tail. Tail? Oh, tail. Tail. <laughs> so Katie reluctantly agreed, but I think she's gonna be just fine. All right, I'm gonna head out. Yes, I'm gonna go get my toesies done. Don't look at them. Ryan isn't even home from school yet. Hi, buddy. But Ryan has his first babysitting job right. today. Do you know that? Is he babysitting? Christopher. Nice. Oh my gosh, look what she just did. Oh, I thought she was gonna lay on me. Yeah, so he's gonna. I know she does. She's a shedder now. I need to take that little brush out and brush her. Get all the stuff out. All right, you guys. We'll see you in a few. This is the last day of the first week of school. What would you give the week, the first week of school, Brennan, on a scale of or A, B, C, D, E? Um, bruh. First week. Mm hmm B. A B? Yes. That's not too terrible. No. Right? Because it wasn't too terrible. Okay, excellent. What would have made it an A? Mm, if I had better people in my classes. Oh. Yeah. Sorry, no offense to all those people in Brennan's classes. You just mean not your friend. Like, you don't have your friends. Well, I need more, more friends. Yeah, Katie said she doesn't have any friends in any of her classes. It's mm, not good. All right, we're having people over here at 6 o'clock. And I need to get my toes done and get ready. Who's and here at 6? Um, a bunch of people before the parte. The homies? Yeah. The regs. A little pretty party. Yes. And this one's sitting in my lap, and I cannot ask her to get off because she's just so comfy cozy. Maybe you could sit on Ryan, Brennan's back. She's could you do sleeping. that? No, she's not. Is she? Oh, oh my gosh. You are so cute. Yeah, she's so I think Edward's outside. Yes. In the rain. He's been yelling outside the front door. He has? Yeah. Why didn't you let him in? No way! I wish you would have told me. Then Katie just went out the door. He must have left. Oh my gosh, I gotta go get him. Hold on. It's the end Mom of the day. Just up here. And I decided to come up on top of Ryan's bed. Now, as you guys know, Ryan has bunk or like a like not even bunk beds. It's a a loft bed. Yeah. So I decided to crawl up here just to see what's going oh, on. She full on like, look what I found. Okay. There is a jar okay. of Jif peanut okay. butter okay. hanging out on top okay. of his okay. armoire that's <laughs> so conveniently located near his bed. Do you eat that, or is that from a long time ago? Okay. Like, what, what's it doing that up was here? From a while ago. And why is it still here? I don't know. Because you don't clean anything. I that's brought why. a banana and peanut butter. When? And like before Christmas? Yeah. Probably. Uh. In like seventh grade. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I don't, I don't know. Yeah, it's been a while. Anyway. Yeah, give me back my covers. All right, so we're going to end our night. Dad and I just got home from our 50th, not ours, but our, our 50th birthday party that we went to for our friend. It was really very fun. I'm tired. But Ryan, what did you do, Ryan, today for the first time ever? Talk to us. I sat a baby. <laughs> Ryan sat a baby. I sat a baby. Um, I babysat. How'd it go? Pretty good. Yes? I also went to the rope swing with Ben and Charlie after school. And yes. I went in Charlie's hot tub. And went on the boat. Nice. Not our boat, but Ben's boat. Yeah. But then he came home and he had a big babysitting gig from 7 to 11. Yeah. Nice work. Yeah. So you kept him nice and healthy and safe and fun. You guys yeah. had fun. Yeah. He babysat Christopher. You guys might you get if you've yeah. watched our vlogs before. You definitely know Christopher. He's our friend's son and also our oh, friend. I'm gonna get that. Oh, get that. Get that. Get that. Oh, it was a mosquito. Dude, any any bug that comes up here is getting done. Done for. Another thing we'll ask you to comment below on is. Do you babysit currently, or have you babysat oh in the past? And if so, I feel like everyone's babysat once in their Katie life. Katie never has. And if you, no. and neither is Brennan. No. Except you. Everyone you. would have, everyone would, would definitely babysit once in their life. 
Okay, so my question is this. Comment below if you have, and what advice you have for for Ryan as a babysitter. Do you have any babysitting advice for Ryan? Please share it, because, I mean, I'm sure he's a fantastic babysitter. I'm not sure no, why he went okay. to bed with he's his hat on. my abilities. No, he's excellent, but if there's anything, I mean, you've only babysat once. Is there Please anything? Please give us tips, because Ryan is horrible. Anything oh you've learned gosh. as a babysitter that you should Don't share with know. Ryan. <laughs> Please let him know some better ways, because he is just a horrible babysitter. Yeah, that's where I'm going with that. All right, so now it's time to share what made us happy. So here we go. Ready? What made me happy today was... Oh, don't I thought that would scare you. What made me happy today was going to my friend's party and catching up with a friend of mine from college who I haven't seen in... Since the Egyptians. 20, since the Egyptians. 27 years. I haven't seen this woman in 27 years. It was fantastic to catch You're up with her. Ancient. Thank you, Ryan. What made you happy today? It being Friday, I can go and do the rope swing. Yeah? Yeah. Awesome sauce. That's pretty much it. That's it. All right, you guys. So, Dad... Oh, so Brennan is still out. He went to watch It too in the movie theater. Oh, really? So Yeah, so he's there now. Nice. Katie is asleep in her room. Dad is outside uh, watching TV, sure so we're, I'm pretty sure she's asleep. Mm, okay. You don't think she's sleeping? I just don't feel like, if she isn't, I don't feel like getting down off the bed and asking her to meet her. I yeah, I'm to sure she had a happy some day. Water or something. I need some okay. Or something. So, we're going to wrap it up tonight, you guys. Thank you so much for watching our video. We hope you enjoyed it. We hope we, we you were entertained and maybe learned a little or have something to share with us. And comment down below what made you guys happy today, and we will see you Ow. tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.